Well, hey folks, PC7 here, and welcome back to the channel. Glad to have you today as we have another look at Gearstorm. Now, I had restarted this game um, because, well, I'd reached a point in the missions where when I logged out and logged back in and went to the same save, there were no missions of, like, the current mission wasn't there, and when I went back to the person to give the missions, they wanted to start me all the way over at, you know, get the the very first thing done again go find a build tool so yeah i restarted the whole thing finished all of the kind of tutorial bits was assigned the mission to go check out the new camp and logged out came back in to play some more and well guess what yeah no mission listed and the guy wants me to start all again. Now, I know it's the same save, because I have like 8,000 rounds of ammunition, and I have all the cooked meat that I did on the last one. And So, what I'm going to do, I, I, I don't know. The developer says he can't seem to recreate it. I can't seem to stop it from happening every single time. This is the fourth time I've restarted the game and campaign. So, I thought today, before we completely give up on this thing... <laughs> We're just going to uh, try the survival mode. So this is basically you get dropped onto the planet and... Oh. Freshly generated clone. You can choose a location to spawn. All right. Um, oh, and you get to choose a loadout as well. I don't see what the difference is. Oh, okay. Different weaponry. So we can start with the Gauss Rifle, the Arch Pistol, or the Shoddy. Yeah. I don't really have a problem with the, uh, the pistol, actually. I'm not a big fan of the rifle. Appearance? Alright, that'll do. Eye color, don't care. Face, that's yeah, fine. Hairstyle, he doesn't really seem to have any, so <laughs> I guess that'll do. Alright. Um, what have we got here? Border Town, MSF Vault, EDI HQ, ICA HQ, Iron. Iron. <laughs> Okie dokie. Um, hmm. How about we try Border Town? Sound good? Squad. I don't have a squad. So, build your first campfire. Collect 10 wood, 10 stone using your build gun. Alright. Now, I've never done this mode before. Hopefully, uh, we're not going to be sitting here on a loading screen for five minutes. If we are, I apologize in advance. But from the looks of things, by the time I'm done apologizing, we're going to be on our way in. Oh, yeah, right. We need to uh, keep this puppy in the green. I don't see anything terribly special around yet. Okay, so... Other than there seems to be some sort of a... Well, I guess that's the town, eh? <laughs> some sort of a building establishment over there. Oh, that's the wrong way. I wanted to actually get over to the edge a little bit there. I think I still want to be a little further over here. There we go. You have to make sure you uh, save enough fuel, because you've only got so much of it. <laughs> and they really don't give you any indicator. Well, I mean, they give you an altimeter, but it's not like you have a, uh, a known fuel rate you're going to be burning. And we're down. Nice. Do I really want to exit it while it's still that smoking hot? Sure. Okay, we're out. We've got our build gun loaded. We're a dangerous crew. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah. 
I'd feel a little better with this puppy running. Thank you. Okay, press one for... Well, let's have a look at our inventory here. So one is a handheld scanner. Cool. It's not really where I'd want that. And two is our med kits. Yeah, I guess that'll do for now. All right. I don't see anything about to bite our heads off. Sweet. So apparently... Uh, they would like us to... Build a campfire. Ten wood, ten stone. Alright. Yeah. Whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, that guy doesn't look like he's friendly, does he? Well, that answers that question. Holy. Oh man, my controller is bad. Alright, well, that, uh, that kind of sucked really, really hard. <laughs> okay, um, can we not just, like, appear in the middle of nowhere? I want the same loadout. Uh, I don't think I want to start there, though. How about, uh, what's this? MSF Vault. And I, okay, Iron? Oh we, oh, we, can we spawn? Oh, we can spawn anywhere. Alrighty. Well, let's not spawn right where there's a bunch of freaking people then, okay? <laughs> let's spawn here. Sure. <laughs> yes, that went so well. <laughs> Man. Okay, not so good. Oh. If you're new, best to try to spawn near a friendly base. Well, I got news for you, man. That last place? Yeah, that wasn't too friendly. Uh huh. Not at all. So we'll try a middle of nowhere. And yes, as long as we don't land in a tree, we don't have to worry about hitting buildings this time. I might have known all them creeps was hanging around. I'd have landed right on top of them. I'll bet that would have given them something to think about, wouldn't it? Oh man, I think I was going to land in a tree. <laughs> that would figure. Get a little further over there. There we go. Well, I feel a little more confident here that we might at least survive long enough to uh, get our ten pieces of wood. There we are. A perfect landing, and we're out. Okay, now there are very dangerous animals. That's kind of, I guess the uh, the down part of not being near civilization. Whoa, whoa, oh man! I had no idea there were things like that. Well, that's a great start. <laughs> If something isn't out to kill me, I'm out to kill myself. All right, note to self. Look where you're going, dummy. All right, let's see if we can scan a tree and get our ten bits of wood. Now, I think that thing over there is a... F re well... Friendly might be a bit... Uh, how many pieces? Is it not telling me how many... Oh, wood collected 34. Okay, well, that counts. I think they wanted me to try and collect 10. Alright, what do we... well... 
I think that guy's more or less friendly as well. Alright, let's go back down here. Because I'm pretty sure something I saw was, yes, stone. Alright. Okay. So now... Find a safe place to start your camp. Oh, it wouldn't be here. New, 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 new. That's a raptor, man. Oh. Oh. I think he's fighting with that thing. Yep. They're having at her. Alrighty. Now, like I said, I don't think we need to worry about this. He, I mean, he looks upset and such. I don't blame him. But, oh, is he going to... Yeah, okay, that's what I thought. They don't really care about us. Or at least I think these ones are friendly. <laughs> the way they... You good, man? Yeah? Alright. Because, yeah. I'd like to get a little bit of meat from this if I could. Awesome. Look at that. Cool. Thanks, bro. Ooh, scary stuff, let me tell you. Hmm. Well, I wonder if this place wouldn't be too bad, you know? There's only one way in and one way out. Well, the one way out may not be too smart, but... Of course, I have to worry about things falling on my head. What's that? 4,000 meters, there's something in that direction. Hmm. Well, let's go for a wander. Let's get this campfire thing here. So, G should build up. What? Uh, yeah, G doesn't seem to be that particular menu. What are they asking here? Uh, yeah, that's not the build... Oh, maybe I actually have to have the build gun. There we go. <laughs> yes, user error, 100%. So, a campfire. That is a campfire, is it not? Yeah. 10 stone, 10 wood. Uh-huh. Looks good. Looks good. Uh-huh. Okay. How do we actually go about crafting it? I don't want to dig or harvest materials. Campfire. What? Okay. Um, sure, we'll put it there. Okay. Can we make some rusted mitt? Yes. We will have that. And we need some fuel. Alright. We want to make some meat. Make many, many meat. Uh, four to be exact. There we go. Good stuff, good stuff. What? Okay. Tablets, displays, and another cave. Okay. Find shelter. Oh, caves, eh? Alright, well, they recommend that you try a cave, so. How's this doing? Ah, four cooked meat. You evil. And this. Blah, blah. So, can I pick this up? F. Lock, label, hmm. There we go. Because... Yeah. I 
might feel a little safer down here. What do we got there? Gold? Wow, this is quite the cave. We should be able to do well. Alright, we're going to put our campfire down. Right there. It's too bad it doesn't really give off any light, but there you are. Now, is there a way... Does it even show us? Oops, I didn't want to do that. Well, this is us here, right? Wow. Yeah. Massive conglomerate of stuff, eh? Okay. Yeah, we're going to eventually make our way there. So, to build your first base core, find a copper deposit, harvest 10 copper, smelt these into copper ingots in your campfire. Okay. Well, I'm going to bet you there's copper in here. Oh, look. Copper. Any more? I thought I saw coal. Lovely. Gold, stone, oh, copper. No ammo. What? Oh. <laughs> All right. So, yeah, that still leaves us an easy way out over there. Nice. All right, let's see just how much copper it takes to make ingots, shall we? Okay, let's put our wood back in here. That's going to be our big usage right now. And copper ingots, there we go. All right, one per one. That looks good to me then. Let's make uh, 20 of them. Sure. Ah, okay. Alrighty, there's ten. Find appetite crystals. AP crystals. Huh. Well, I certainly haven't run across any of those. So maybe this isn't going to be our best bet as for places to live. Hmm. Flare grenade, a throwable light source. Oh, yeah. I don't think so. Hmm. Yeah, I mean, there's lots of other stuff in here. Copper, gold, you name it. Well, I haven't run across iron yet. Coal. Nice. It's getting pretty dark out there, isn't it? Gold stone. Yeah. We will eventually make our way there, but... For now... Oh, good, it's raining. That's even better, isn't it? Yes, it is. All right, so we're going to hang back here by our campfire. Now, hmm? oh, <laughs> not sure what I just did there, but it's not what I intended to do. So we can make wooden chests, crafting bench. Hmm. 
Wooden walls, okay. Wooden doors. So we have the capability of actually building a sort of a shelter. Oh, a torch. What do I need for that? Just wood. Ooh, alrighty. Well, that's good to know. Rough wood. Yeah. Alright. Since I think we're going to be at least spending the night here, we might as well get a little bit of light going on. And let's uh, go into our inventory. Let's grab a meat and use one of those. There we go. Now our health is coming back up. Eh, some. Could probably use another one, wouldn't hurt us. There we go. Back up to pretty much full health. We got some coal, we got some copper. Yeah, we don't have that many rounds. We had a lot more when I was at that base. But yeah, as soon as we get enough daylight here, we're going to uh, head out. So, the nice thing is, of course, you can pick up everything you place down. Is there a clock kind of thing going on anywhere? Not that that was expensive to build either of those. A torch is just a stick of wood, after all. Yeah, it's kind of dismal, isn't it? No, don't worry, dude. Although it looks like maybe dawn is breaking. Cool. Hmm. Whoa. Not good. Dang! What the? What was that? Since he got carrion, yeah, we'll take that. Man, what a nut bar! Yeah, I wasn't expecting him. Hey, right on. Need some more meat here. Just that, eh? He's still twitching. Okay, that'll come in handy. As well this. Just carry in, eh? Alright, well, the sun is a coming up. But what I want to do here... Let's quickly go back down. Hey, we managed to uh, get through that without getting beat up. Nice. <laughs> I'm going to quickly use this campfire and cook up the rest of that meat. Boom. And our logs. We're going to make this. Excellent. Uh, five, make. And then make the rest of them. Okay, this I think I want to swap out for our meat supply. There, now we can eat on the run if we have to. Um, yeah. Not a lot of rounds left. What do we got? Six of these? Oh, I guess that's all we had left, isn't it? There we go. Last one. We'll take our extra wood. Alright, 
No. So we'll head towards that marker. It's okay, dude. It's just me. Man, it's kind of dark and freaky out here, isn't it? Yeah. They don't give you a lot of time, do they? All right. There's a group of raptors. Good, these guys aren't completely useless then. Alright. There's a pack of raptors, but they've got something else on their mind. So we're gonna let them, uh, let them carry on doing that. There's another one there, but he's heading for food as well. Oh, yeah. Oh. Yeah, they're all getting in on that one. I don't know if I give that guy much of a chance. Make sure we're not getting ambushed anywhere. No. Good stuff. Alright, we got a little bit of stamina. Let's make a bit of a run. What's this then? Ah, these could be these crystals. They are. Seems to be all of it. So this is uh, what they were suggesting is shelter. That's a lot harder to get into than where I was. So this just seems to be stone, eh? Oh, hey. This one has a way in and a way out. Well, that's unique. That also makes it way less of a good shelter than the last cave we were in. That looks like coal. An important resource, but... We've got a little bit of it, and that's about all you do need. You see there's still some glitches going on with the uh, terrain generation. There's that stretch texture. Yeah, that's all right. This is early access. Those sort of things are certainly forgivable. All right, let's keep heading towards this. I'm hoping we can make it in one daylight run. Just got to keep our eyes open because he's... Beasties don't make that much noise. Ah, uh, yeah. Good. I was hoping they would do that. Because where they came from is in fact a nest. Where you can 
all kinds of cool stuff. You just gotta watch out for stuff like that. Well, he's obviously got something else on his mind now. That's alright, we got whatever was in that nest. I wish I felt like I was safe enough to actually... Uh, stop and look in my inventory. <laughs> Ooh, what do we got? There's something freaking out behind these trees. I don't know if they're friendly. They kind of look like a wild dog. Well, I'm going to run away. Because, you know, it's kind of what I do. <laughs> nah, it's just that's never uh, never bad advice on an alien planet if you're in doubt of the uh, local wildlife. Is uh, avoid them. How far away are we? Man, that's a long ways, that place. That is, let's see what we managed to find ourselves. Slug mags, okay. A little more EM. That's always nice. So we get 200 rounds now. Cool. Very good. Let's, uh, let's go here. What do we got up there? Nice, free meat. Thanks, dude. Know that that will not go to waste. Man, you gotta be so careful around here. Whoa. Oh, okay. I think they're reasonably friendly as long as you don't really get in their face. Alright, here's some more of these. Whoa, another cave. Brilliant. Okay, I found caves, yeah. Uh-oh. I run myself out of stamina. That's probably not good. Not good. No shortage of wildlife. I can't say as I'm fond that they went with this sort of dinosaur theme thing. You know? Not really. Whoa. Hey, there's some more of those crystals. And seeing as those guys have already got something else on their mind. You do too, don't you? Yeah, you're already locked in somewhere else. What are these? Hmm, interesting. Okay, I do feel kind of exposed down here. No, we could go up there and get some more free meat. Because he's doing a heck of a number on these things. Yeah, he got them all. Right on, buddy. Thank you. I'm what you call a scavenger of carrion. Nice. Nice. We will, uh... Uh, nice. <laughs> we'll let him deal with that. That doesn't hurt my feelings at all. Let's continue on towards this place. I'm hoping we can make it in one day. I don't want to spend a, spend a night out here if we can help it. It's not the uh, nicest place in the world, man. I ran myself out of stamina again. Looks like I've got a limited time before I need to rest as well. So I don't know why that didn't update. 
We got the crystals. What is that? Well, it didn't come after me. Always a good sign. What do we got? Plant fiber. Well, that's probably good. It's usually a useful substance in these survival style games. We got full stamina again. Let's get moving. Are these not AP crystals? Am I in just the wrong universe here? They sure are. Hmm. Huh. I wonder why it won't update. That's supposed to be a sign of shelter nearby. I'm not seeing it. Not seeing it. How are we doing here? Oh man, we're still... Uh, we've made about half the distance we need to cover. I can't say that's a good thing. Okay, you're cool. Let's keep going, keep going, keep going. I mean, it looks like the numbers go down quick, but we don't seem to be really getting anywhere. <laughs> It's okay, they've still got, they've got something in mind. It seems most of them are in the middle of a hunt when you see them, so. And as long as they are, they don't seem to want to bother you, which is nice. Uh-huh. I'm starting to have my doubts that we're going to make that place by nightfall. Hmm. I noticed, too, that the, uh, gauge with the lightning bolt, I can only assume some sort of an energy thing... It is also going down. Okay, that's another nest. So are they going to go join? They are. Excellent. Cool, because there's two of them fighting. So we're going to grab all we can. Oh no, we're too heavy. All right. Fair enough. I could see that coming. Um. Let's eat a meat. Alright. Let's stop here for a moment and have a look. Um, I'll throw that away. And what are these? Wow, those are heavy. I'm going to drop those as well. What are these? Oh, eggs we're keeping. Plant fiber we could use. Yeah, the rest of this stuff is pretty much... Huh. We'll build a new campfire. Alright. That should put our weight below. Right? Energy weight 931... 93.1 of 100. Alright, it puts us just below. But at least now we'll be able to uh, jog and such again. How much does that meat weigh? Is it heavy? Who? Well, 8.5 for that whole bunch. But I think we've got enough. Let's just try and get to... Uh, get to this new zone. Stay nice and close to these raptor magnets. Because <laughs> they take all the scary out of those guys. Alright, see there goes another herd of them. But again, they're heading towards one of those dudes and not me. So, oh, what is that? You see that? There's fire up there. Oh. Yeah, you go ahead and look after that. I gotta go see what this is about. What have we got here? Package. Huh. Interesting. Alright. Let's continue on. A little bit of a long episode. I do apologize if that uh, is an issue with you guys. You can always watch it in chunks. <laughs> 
right, so you watch that. I'll be blowing chunks. Okay. All right, a little bit of rainfall. Can't say is it's uh, the most impressive weather effects I've ever seen, but hey, it's weather effects. They weren't in there just not too terribly long ago. What are you doing, man? I didn't do nothing to you. All right. Well, let's continue to head on over towards this, uh, hopefully, outpost of humanity and all that. What we got going on here? Uh, these are these weird dogs, eh? All right, well, we're going to avoid them. It looks like something else that the raptors eat are those little dogs. But, yeah... And they're pretty smart. They go running right towards those dudes who immediately destroy the raptors. So yeah, that's good thinking on their part. Yeah, quite a lot of them here, too. Alright, we just made under the 1,000 meter mark. So we started at 4,000. So we're three quarters of the way to whatever this place is, man. It's only, as you can see, it's actually counting them now. sure I heard something. All right, we got a little bit of stamina here. No, nah, not much. Let's try and save it. <laughs> I'm not sure what it's counting. I guess it's just like an automatic rangefinder, like that tree's 26 and a half meters. That guy is... 62 meters. I don't know. The rock is uh, 37 meters. Yeah, it seems to be. And if you focus it right on there, it does seem to go out to the right range, but only if nothing else is in the way. Hmm. Okay. What's that? Coal? Uh, yeah. That's all right. We'll worry about that. My biggest concern right now is just getting ourselves to this shelter area, which is half a click away now. Because I got a feeling that lightning thing, I think that's sleep. And... Yeah. I know that there's beds in those bases, or at least there is in the one that you do your tutorial mission. Oh no, that symbol I'm heading towards, that's where I died. I can just make out what it says now. Oh man, so this is where we originally spawned. Well, that's not good. That's not where I want to be. Not at all. I've actually been going completely the opposite. Oh, my sp oh that is only a spawn point. It's not a... Well, that's great. Yeah. This is entirely not where I want to be. Um, although, I suppose. If I can take it away from them, that would... Uh, would certainly give me a place, wouldn't it? Hmm. There's one of them weird giant sand flea things or whatever the heck they are. I'm not really wanting to get too close to it. Oh, yeah. Yeah, if I was coming back here, I probably should have... Let's get down to crouchy...
Yeah, it's unfortunately, but the 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 combat doesn't really seem to have any uh any sort of real weight to it, which kind of sucks, you know. Okay, that's one. Get back into a crouched position here. It's starting to get dark again. I don't like that. Okay, there's another one there. Ooh, and another one there. No! Did that? No, he didn't spot us. Oh man, there's a lot of them. Oh, that wasn't a good choice. Well, what the heck, man? How many shots does it take to kill these things? That's ridiculous. Well, I think rather than respawn right now, we're going to call her good for this episode, guys. So that's the survival thing. Yeah, note to self, don't go to the enemy encampment. <laughs> Hope you enjoyed. If you did, you know what to do. Hit that like button. Till next time, this has been Species 7. Take care of each other. Stay the heck away from each other. And then ciao for now.